If you've ever tried building an app with AI, you've probably run into the same problems. Tools that look impressive in ads, but once you're inside, they give you half-finished designs, broken code, or a mock-up you can't actually use. It feels exciting at first, but then you hit a wall. And the promise of AI-built apps in minutes just turns into wasted time and frustration. You don't need another tool that looks good in a promo video but falls apart under real use. Base44 was designed to give you reliable, production-ready apps every time. No placeholders, no half-finished builds, just results you can trust. The difference is in the details. Real-time previews, automatic error fixing, visual editing tools, and one-click publishing all built into the same workspace. It's designed so you can go from an idea in your head to a working app you can share in the same session. In this tutorial, I'm going to prove it by building a complete Frame.io style collaboration app from scratch. We'll cover video uploads, timestamp comments, inviting collaborators, and even refining the design with Google's material design principles all without touching a single line of code. You'll see firsthand how Base44 handles both functionality and design with ease, and why it's the most reliable and powerful option available right now. But nothing shows Base44's power better than trying it yourself, so feel free to use the link in the description and follow along as I build a website using Base44. Starting a project in most AI builders usually feels like guesswork. You're staring at an empty prompt box, trying to figure out how much detail to type, and hoping the output looks halfway decent. Here, I don't have that problem. I can be specific right from the start, and Base44 takes everything I write and turns it into a working app or website with the design and features already connected. Here's the exact prompt I'm dropping in. Follow Google's material design principles with paper-like cards, bold colors, and responsive animations. Use elevation shadows to indicate hierarchy and focus. Implement a consistent grid system with proper spacing and alignment. The buttons should be flat with hover effects and ripple animations on click. Use Google's typeface recommendations and follow material color palette guidelines. Add subtle transitions between states and responsive micro interactions. Create a video collaboration app where users can upload videos, invite collaborators, and add comments on timestamps. Watch what happens here. The interface follows Google's material design rules, so the layout already feels clean and professional. Good spacing, smooth transitions, consistent typography. At the same time, the core functionality is baked in from the start. I can upload a video, drop timestamp comments, and even send invites to collaborators right inside this first build. This is why I like working in Base44. I'm not patching design later, I'm not rebuilding features that got left out, I'm starting with something that looks sharp and actually works. That foundation means I can spend my time improving the app instead of fixing what the builder missed. The reality is, no build is ever perfect on the first try, and that's exactly what makes a tool like Base44 so valuable. While testing the app, we can see here that the video upload feature is noticeably slow. But I am not gonna leave that part out. I'll keep it in to show what actually happens when you hit a snag in real time. The fix here is incredibly simple. All I need to do is tell Base44, the video upload is taking too long, and it will immediately adjust the process to improve performance. On top of that, Base44 also automatically detects conflicts during the upload process and offers suggestions suggestions through its built-in error handling. The autofix button in the corner pops up right when I need it, giving me a one-click way to resolve the issue without breaking the flow of building. This shows that even when something doesn't go perfectly, Base44 will not leave you stuck. Other AI tools might throw errors and force you to start over, but here the system actually helps you recover. That means less frustration, no wasted progress, and the confidence to keep moving forward. Exactly what you need if you want to build fast without worrying about hitting dead ends. One of the most frustrating parts of building with other AI tools is when you know something doesn't feel right, 
but you're left guessing how to fix it. You either have to start rewriting prompts from scratch, or worse, settle for a design that doesn't actually work for your users. Discuss mode in Base44 solves that gap by letting me talk through what feels off and get actionable suggestions in real time. Here, I'll turn on Discuss mode and type. The current video player is difficult to work with. Uh, how do you think we should improve it to be more user-friendly? Right away, Base44 responds with thoughtful, actionable suggestions. These aren't random guesses, they're designed focused recommendations that directly improve usability. Now, I'm going to switch Discuss mode off and follow up with a direct prompt. Implement the suggested improvements. Base44 immediately applies the changes, and the video player looks and feels noticeably more polished. This would normally take trial and error across multiple rebuilds, but here, it is resolved in a single flow. This is where the depth of Base44 really shows. It adapts in real time, thinks through improvements with you, and acts almost like a design partner. For anyone who's struggled with AI tools that leave you stuck with a good enough build, this changes the experience completely. You're not just building faster, you're building smarter. And you end up with an app that's genuinely user-friendly without second guessing. So here's something I know you're gonna appreciate. Because once your app is built, you always want to tweak the look and feel. With most builders, that's where the frustration starts. Base44 handles this completely differently. I'm gonna open up visual edit mode and right away, you can see how smooth this feels. I can change the color scheme to better match a creative app aesthetic, and the entire vibe of the interface shifts instantly. I'll adjust the layout elements for cleaner spacing and stronger hierarchy, and again, those changes appear right away in the preview panel. No reloads, no lag, it all updates in real time. This means you're refining your app or website visually, in the flow, without touching a single line of code. You can polish text, tweak colors with precision, and adjust spacing until everything looks professional. You are not going to get stuck fixing messy layouts like you would with other builders, and you'll move forward confidently, knowing your app is not only functional, but ready to show off. Now, I want to push a little deeper and show you some of the advanced features that really separate Base44 from the other builders out there. The first one is custom AI instructions. This is where I can fine-tune how the app behaves by giving Base44 extra context or direction. I can even select different AI models to adjust the generation style, which means I'm not locked into a one-size-fits-all approach. It feels more like tailoring the AI to work the way I want, rather than just accepting whatever it spits out. Next is the Add Files feature, and here, creativity really opens up. I'm going to attach a photo as inspiration and type. Attached is a photo that will serve as app inspiration. I try to implement the inspiration into this app. Right away, Base44 pulls design elements like color and layout directly from that image and integrates them into the app. It's not just copying, it's interpreting and applying the style, so the final product feels unique and aligned with the vision I'm going for. Whenever a conflict or bug appears, Base44 immediately suggests fixes. Before moving on, I want to pause and show you the Base44 interface itself, because the tools built into the dashboard make the whole experience a lot smoother. At the top right area is the Activity Monitor, which logs every change and background task as they happen. Over here is the Code Shortcut, which is a direct way to open up and review the generated code whenever you want. Export options are built right in as well, so I can package the entire project into a zip file or push it straight to GitHub. The share button generates a live preview link I can send to others, and the publish button takes the app live with one click. All of this sits inside a clean, organized dashboard, so navigation will be a lot quicker and uncluttered. It's easy to find what you need without digging through endless menus, which makes the whole process smooth from the very beginning. Alright, let's actually test the website we built. I'll upload a demo video, and it plays right inside the app without any extra settings. Now, I'm going to add timestamped comments, and each one locks to the exact frame I choose.
shoes. That's huge for collaboration because feedback doesn't get lost in Slack threads or long email chains. If you ever tried reviewing video projects across different tools, you know how much context gets lost. Base44 keeps the feedback anchored in the app itself, which saves time and prevents mistakes when you're making revisions. In a single session, I put together a frame.io style app with working video uploads, timestamp comments, built-in collaboration, and a polished material design interface. That's not a mock-up, that's a functional app you can hand to a team and start using today. That's why I see Base44 as more than just a builder. It gives you the power of a development tool with the flexibility of a creative partner. Again, if you want to see what Base44 can do for your own projects, the link's in the description. Try it yourself. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.